A distress phone call leads us to Nairobi, South B Estate, where police have reported one of the most brutal murders since the year began. This is Taletwa Hu, sister to Pastor Kanyari. The 24-year-old lady met her unfortunate death in an Airbnb in South B. We don't know what happened, but from the crime scene, it seems that the lady really struggled so that she could save her life. Pool of blood was everywhere in that house. Outside the house, there was no any stain of blood. If you've not watched the story and you want to watch the full clip, just search it in K24 TV or BNN. At the moment, so many people have shared the disheartening clip. If you don't have that art of watching, don't watch because it's so disheartening. Even if it's your family member, you wouldn't like to watch something like that. So many exhibits have been displayed in that clip. So I'm just giving you a warning. Don't watch that clip if you don't have a heart. It's so heartbreaking. May her soul rest in peace. Let's keep praying for the family. Ladies hang out with guys they have met. They know each other. Others, they don't know each other well. Maybe they've just met in an online platform and decide to hang out in an Airbnb. It's just that for Starlet Wahoo, her story turned out to be unfortunate. So let's not pretend as if these things don't happen. My dear ladies, whenever you're going out with someone, it's advisable you should at least know this person very well. As much as people may pretend, don't just go out with any stranger. For now, it has already happened. We can't do anything. Let's just keep praying for her family to get strength, especially during these trying moments. Imagine when you see such a crime scene that it's believed that your loved one was killed in that specific scene. It is so heartbreaking. It is so unfortunate. It is so painful, especially to the family. My sincere condolences goes to the Pastor Kanyaris family and the whole family at large for losing this young soul. May the soul of the late Starlet Wahoo rest in peace and may the perpetual light shine upon her always. Amen.